Hi, today we'll be looking at how to create dynamic drop-down menus in IBM Biz Automation Workflow. All right, so we're looking at the example here where we have a field with a state and a view with a city. As you click on the state, the, the city view should change from A, B, C to D, E, and F and back and forth. So from Arizona back to Alabama, we see that the city field has changed. So how does this actually work? So in BAW, we'll go to the actual coach view, the customer view, and we have a look at the, the first object, uh, the state object over here. Now, before we do that, let's have a quick look at the variables that exist here. And in the form, we have the customer object, and we also see the state and province object. So these are all simple, simple objects, okay? Now, as we click on the servers, for that, um, uh, that service is linked to the object, we can then see that inside the service, we have created a few variables. And inside the logic, we have uh, uh, some uh, scripting to actually populate those variables. We're using a local variable type and we're simply adding all the states in that variable type. Okay, so we're simply retrieving it from that uh, service. However, in the second one, the city, we also have a service input data. So that actually forms the input data to the retrieve cities service. So that input data comes from that state object that we have defined before, right? We have the state object, and the state object forms the input to the city script, right? So here the state object, we can see is bound to a, um, uh, the, the state object, and now then the city one will be using that as the input to the city script. So inside the city script, we'll have a look at the variables again, they then result variables, but in here, the implementation, you can see that we can then simply use that input if data is, in this case, Alabama, we're gonna set the cities to A, B, and C. If it's something else, we're gonna set it to D, E, and F. So it's a very simple way of actually creating dynamic content based on the, the variables from two different drop-down menus.